Hi, my name is Vaman Deshmukh and in this session, we are going to discuss package variables. Package variables also called as global variables or public variables. In PL SQL, uh, a package can have many members, it can have variables, it can have types, it can have uh, cursor, exception, procedure, function. Similarly, package also can have, you know, variables. Now, package has two different parts to create a package, like you have got package specification and package body. So, those variables which you declare in the package specification, they are called as package variables. Uh, more specifically, they are also called as uh, public variables or you can also call them global variables. Uh, they are called as public uh, variables because uh, package members declared within a package specification. Uh, they are public members and they can be accessed uh, generally from anywhere in the application. On the other hand, those variables or those package members which are declared within the package body only, uh, basically which are declared within a certain procedure or function or other object, those are called as package, uh, I mean those are called as private members, they are not accessible from outside. So, in this session, uh, let us see how do you declare uh, you know public variables in a package and how do you access them from anywhere in your application. So, here uh, I am going to write a small uh, package declaration and in that uh, I will declare some variables and I will show you how to use those variables outside the package. So, look at this code. Here, uh, I am creating a package, create or replace package PC1 is and in that I am going to declare 5 variables, 3 number variables and 2 work at 2 variables and you could see package has been created. Now, you should note a point here uh, that if your package contains procedures or functions, in that case you will need package body as well, but if your package contains uh, only variables, it if it does not contain any kinds of uh, you know procedures and functions in that case package body is not required ok. So, here I have given package specification and that is sufficient uh, the package variables or global variables have been declared. Now, we can use those variables in any program, sub program, any other package procedure function wherever you want. Let me show you one simple example here. So, look at this uh, sub program, here I want to declare uh, two numbers and you know uh, by using those two numbers I want to uh, I want to add two numbers and you know get the output. Now, normally what do you need to do? You need to have a declare block and in the declare block you need to declare the variables and in the begin block you need to use those variables, but here in the package PC1 we already have declared those variables right and those public variables we can use them here in this sub program. So, look at this program there is no declare block, I am directly going to begin block and in the, in the begin block I am using those variables pc1.n1, pc1.n2, pc1.n3 right and using those variables I am doing this uh, you know addition operation. So, look at this program the output is here. So, package variables or global variables they can be used in this way, you just need to declare them in, the, in a package in the package specification and then with the package reference and the variable reference you can use them in any program in your application. So, that is a little about package variables, thanks for watching this video to watch more such videos please visit Nourish Technologies, thank you.